What is up guys? It is Carly here bringing you your Tuesday review on body bags and today I'm going to go with an Italian classic and that is the Black Cat from the year 1981. Um, sorry about the angle and stuff by the way guys. Um, I just kind of filmed this on my phone because I didn't feel like setting up the laptop so hopefully this is okay but anyway the Black Cat. Um, this movie is about a town where people start to get killed in these weird accidents of sorts and um, this woman who is a crime photographer starts to suspect that a cat might be behind the crimes just based on what she is seeing and um, when you look at the bodies you see that there's actually like cat scratch marks on the victim so she starts to suspect there is this cat going around killing people and um, you find out that there's actually a man with psychic abilities who is using a cat to um, sort of commit these crimes on these people and yeah that is kind of what's going on in this film. Uh, I know that this is loosely based off of the Edgar Allan Poe story but I'm not too familiar with that story if I'm being completely honest. It's not one that I read back in high school. You know how back in high school you would have to read all those stories in English class and things like that but this was actually not one of them so I can't say that I know much about it or really compare this movie to it. Um, I know it's got its own little twist to it and it's not exactly like the Edgar Allan Poe story but yeah there's that. Um, so going into this movie, um, another thing is you guys probably know by now that I'm not too into the Italian genre just based on what I've seen. I don't really like giallo films or anything like that so I'm not huge on it but I was actually really happy with this movie. I really like the plot and the idea of a cat killing people. Um, I just think it's um, a very cringy thing seeing like claw marks and blood and stuff like that from a cat because I have cats of my own. They are actually black cats and um, I know that it hurts when you get clawed by a cat. So I just think um, the scratch marks and the blood in this movie is very effective and kind of makes me feel a little bit sick. Um, some of it looks kind of fake but it still uh, kind of grosses me out so I did like it for the blood effects in the movie and um, uh, just the idea of a cat going around killing people is a pretty unique thing to see on screen. Obviously this is adapted from a story long ago but um, I've never actually seen a killer cat movie. I know there are other ones out there that exist but this was the first one that I have seen and I thought it was pretty solid. Uh, there's some moments with the cat where the cat looks kind of fake, I mean, which it kind of has to just based on what it's doing, but um, it's not overly cheesy and fake or anything like that. I think they do a pretty good job with the way the cat looks, especially for the time when this movie was made, so I thought that was pretty solid. Um, the characters in this movie are all right. I don't really love the photographer character. Um, she's just kind of strange to me. That's just kind of the vibe I get from her, just the way she looks and acts and things like that. Uh, that's one issue I've always had with Italian films is I don't always love the characters and I find them to be, um, in some movies I get them mixed up just because uh, I can't really decipher their personalities but in this movie you're not dealing with a million characters so it's not a major deal for me. Um, but yeah, I thought the story was pretty cool. Um, another issue I always have with these films is I feel like they kind of drag in some instances and um, in this movie I didn't really feel that as much as I have with other Italian movies that I've seen but I still get, got the um, vibe a little bit throughout and got a little bit bored in some parts but uh, it wasn't awful or anything like that so um, overall I was pretty happy with this movie. Um, it did surprise me because I kind of went into it not expecting too much even though I know this is a movie that everyone likes and talks about. Um, I knew that that probably wouldn't matter to me because I don't really like these types of movies personally but um, I ended up really enjoying it for what it is and just the plot in general. So if you have not seen this movie and you do like Italian films I would definitely say check it out because it's got a pretty unique plot for what it is and um, it's just pretty interesting to watch. So um, I gave this movie a 7.5 out 
out of 10. So yeah, the black hat, definitely check it out if you have not yet. Um, thank you guys for joining me for this Tuesday review and I will see you next week.